like you have invested 2 years for this exam suddenly you made this tough decision of quitting the job so i was posted as assistant director in uh, central electricity authority but after i joined job uh, that's ajay who had clear till interview in his very first esc attempt and in second year got all india rank 26 in upsc esc exam in this video ajay shares his upsc journey i was getting in hand around uh, on my last working day the power salary and allowances of ies officer so let's start with journey so it's a long story um, i was working in infosys back then okay. i resigned uh, from infosys and i came to hyderabad for coaching so then the coaching started and uh, my preparation was really good at that time in the first attempt itself uh, somehow i messed up my gate exam couple of questions uh, went in a wrong direction and from okay. then everything got messed up so i got okay. uh, 2000 rank uh, in gate that year so my preparation was on point but uh, somehow i messed up gate but my mm. esc prelims went really good i got a mm. uh, very good score and mains also i cleared in interview mm. i was uh, short of some 20 marks in the final list i could not make up the final list i appeared right. in interview but uh, i was not in the final list so you are so like again in the first attempt itself you cracked prelims mains and you just hmm. went into first interview yeah so uh, at this point that I was my first attempt first attempt so yeah provided this case like uh, i was curious to know what is gate or esc which is easier uh, you cannot say easy or difficult but in esc you get multiple chances even if you mess up uh, one paper there are four papers technical two papers i mean prelims two papers mains two papers even if you mess up a single paper due to some bad luck there are three papers to compensate but in gate exam you don't have any chance again to prove yourself but okay, um, so since there are lot of uh, questions um, there is no factor for luck here because in okay, prelims uh, gs paper you will have 100 questions in hmm. uh, technical paper you have 150 questions so okay. 250 questions uh, luck do not favor much okay right cool. uh, luck can favor only if there are 5 to 10 questions uh, and uh, if you mess up three or four questions then you are gone okay. Okay, so that's cool. why i'm telling uh, gate a bit of uh, luck should also favor but in esc okay. luck cannot favor because there are okay, multiple cool. stages uh, in every stage luck cannot favor you by the way if you are someone looking for a good coaching for gate and esc at an affordable cost check out gate wala as the best by india's best faculties in both hindi and english and is one of the most loved platforms by students now there is a discount is going on in all of their batches check it out and using code ragu 500 you will get additional 500 rupees off batch details esc non tech 2025 general studies and engineering aptitude at 4499 super 1500 gate 2025 batch 1500 gate test series 2025 1000 rupees vijay 2.0 gate 2025 rank improvement batch b 5400 rupees parakram gate 2026 batch english and english 7 2200 Shreshat Gate 2027 batch English 9400 Parakram 2.0 Gate 2025 batch B English and English 7200 Shreshat Gate 2027 plus PSUs plus Place of Operation batch B CS and IT 9800 Parakram 2.0 Gate plus PSU plus Place of Operation 2025 batch 999 Also experience infinite learning with batch infinity from PW offering Gate Kazana POQ books and more and I have attached the link in the description use code ragu500 and enroll for your preparations Okay, okay. Right. we come to the point why the prelims mark was less in the first term, but then then what happened? Like you got IES, then what happened? Yeah. What is the power? So the first what question. Is uh, what uh, what is the what is the power that you felt when you get uh, IES? IES officer. You you cannot use the word power actually, uh, but I was really happy uh, when I got to know that I got selected. that uh, mm. was a really good feeling but after i joined job uh, i did not feel like i belong to that uh, particular uh, segment in a, in very briefly yeah briefly the main reason was uh, location i do not want to see myself uh, settling in delhi for the long run and i did not okay. want to waste my prime years uh, living in delhi because okay. in my uh, 35 years of service or 34 years of service at least i need to be in delhi for around 25 years i need to stay in delhi hmm and so i did it, not want it, that how likely is it like you have invested 2 years for this exam and suddenly you made this tough decision of quitting the job does yeah. it actually like yeah. what i mean like uh, did you had any 
uh, I know the job is tough. Did you had any pain or like what was your emotion at that time? I don't want to know the reason. What was your emotion like? You yeah. worked hard for it. <laughs> uh i worked hard uh, i i did not de- i do not deny that i have spent uh, almost 3 years because of covid uh, even though my attempts were two it took me 3 years to join the service so it, mm. i spent almost 3 years uh, preparing for this uh, particular job mm. but if i had thought only about those 3 years i had to spend next uh, 30 30, th- 30 to 35 years in that same job and i do not want to regret at the age of 30 at the age of 60 I do not want to regret that I could have left and I could have pursued some other career option. Mm. So I do not want to have any regrets. So I thought, uh, why not? Let's uh, take this decision now. Cool, cool, cool. So like uh, while you are working on IES, I mean, like how, how can I call you? Like while you're working in ESC or like, while you're working in IES? So I was posted as uh, assistant director in um, Central Electricity Authority. So there is no specific term. You can just call um, assistant director in uh, central electricity. Okay. Also, is it is it okay right to share your salary and allowances that you got? Yeah, uh, for sure. You can uh, check in internet also. I was getting in hand around uh, eighty five thousand uh, on my last working day. So in hand was after tax deduction. It was around eighty five. I think mm-hmm. now it might be around 95 to 1 lakh, uh, in between 95 to 1 lakh, because there would be variation in dearness allowance. So it keeps on mm-hmm. changing every six months. So now okay. I think most likely my colleagues would be making around 1 lakh. See the light from far away, it's down the line. Maybe I should not give up without a fight.